Big 12 title game. That's right. TCU, a two and a half point favorite. Total sits at 62 over Kansas State at 12 p.m. Eastern Time on ABC on Saturday. Now, this is a massive, massive matchup. It's going to pull it up on the screen here and Well, of course, we have got TCU by 1.79 as far as the number is concerned, and that's just based over the last five weeks, right? Uh, This TCU team is going to be healthier in this game, at least on offense, than they've been in quite some time. Uh, You look at the rushing numbers, it's a little bit surprising. TCU number 103 PPA per rush over the last uh, five weeks, that's not great, Uh, but Kansas State's defense is really nothing to write home about as far as their rushing defense. Number 62 PPA per rush, Number 67, rushing success rate allowed. Um, They're number 65 in offensive line yards. I don't know. TCU is running the ball like 53% of the time. Mm, You know, I I just, I don't know uh, that that's really that big of a deal because I think that TCU is going to be pretty healthy here. Like, this is a fired up spot for them. You look at Kansas State on offense. I think the most surprising thing is that they've not been running the ball. Like, we expected this Kansas State team to be a running team. Well, since Will Howard has taken over at quarterback, they have been an absolute juggernaut passing the football number 13 ppa per pass number 10 passing success rate and they are number four in passing explosiveness but you look at that tcu defense and where is their strength it is in the second they are number 15 in ppa per pass allowed number 26 passing success rate allowed number 28 in passing explosiveness allowed so they don't let big plays happen all that often uh you look at havoc rate and whatnot like this is these two teams do match up pretty well uh, i'm very curious how this game is going to turn out uh You've got number eight against number five as far as turnover uh, turnover margin is concerned. You've got number twenty four versus number forty as far as penalties per game. Like this is uh, this is going to be an all out war. These are two really really good football teams, um, and both teams really good as far as defensive field position is concerned. Like uh, you've got TCU number six in defensive field position. Uh, Kansas State is number two. But when it comes to offense, TCU, number 114 in average field position, and uh, Kansas State is number 122 as far as offensive field position. Now, this is over the past five weeks. Uh, It doesn't take into consideration the entire season. At net points per drive, uh, TCU, number 11, uh, Kansas State, number 19. Like, there's... There's a lot to like about both of these teams here. I, I know that the number is a little bit shorter, but I mean TCU's been finding ways to get this done all season long. I, I would have to ride with the Horned Frogs here. Give me TCU to cover two and a half and go on and, and finish this thing out, win the Big 12, get to the playoff in Sonny Dyke's first year. That's just a massive, massive deal for them. Massive. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.